Hello and welcome to day 46 of 101 Facebook Lives. Happy Monday. Hope your day was glorious. Today, I was reminded of something that's very familiar with me. And it's a scripture that I love so much. It says that we are not given the spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. Power, love, and a sound mind. Literally, with my power, my love, and my sound mind, I don't, I don't think that I'll need anything else. The problem is when we don't own our power, when we don't own the love that is pretty much embedded in our DNA, and if we don't own the sound mind that we are given, we're made in the image of God. So we're literally so marvelous and so powerful. And I feel like for years and years and years, I don't know, I feel like we've just been told that we're, we're, not, uh, we're not that powerful, that we are broken, that we are this, that, and whatever. But the, in reality, in the very core of us, it rings true. We're not given the spirit of fear, but of power, sound, uh, power, love, and a sound mind. And when we're operating in our power, when we're operating from an open heart of love and our sound mind, our wisdom, then things are easier things go in the right direction it's easier to feel on our destiny to to work every day knowing that we are being guided we're in the right direction we're we're aligned and so one thing is that when we're operating in our power we know and we're aware that we don't need anybody to act differently or we're not depending on somebody to act differently, to stay grateful and to stay happy. Like our gratefulness and our happiness is not dependent on somebody acting a certain way or they have to change first before I, you know, before I become grateful or happy. So that's not even a part of how we're created. Like when we're in our power, we decide that we're grateful and we stay in in knowing that we have access to higher perspective and that we have the power to choose that higher perspective and to operate in that. And so today I was reminded of that because there are things that happened today that kind of got me out of um, my peace. But as we learn every day to live in wisdom, to live in the spirit of power, love, and a sound mind. It takes everyday practice, and it takes everyday connecting to someone higher than us, our source, my source, my, my God. And so it's just like an everyday learning, and we get better and better as we get anchored and grounded in our faith, and we expand from one glory to another, which feels good, and it feels great. And it's what we're here for. We're not here to forever just suffer and, and, you know, all these things that are happening. So that is my story for today. I will see you tomorrow and have a good night and have a blessed evening. Bye-bye.